Hey friend, welcome to today's encouragement from Our Daily Bread. The devotional for today titled, In All Our Dealings, was written by Marvin Williams. In 1524, Martin Luther observed, Among themselves, the merchants have a common rule, which is their chief maxim. I care nothing about my neighbor, so long as I have my profit and satisfy my greed. More than 200 years later, John Woolman from Mount Holly, New Jersey, let his commitment to Jesus influence his tailor shop dealings. Out of support for the freeing of slaves, he refused to purchase any cotton or dye supplies from companies that used forced labor. With a clear conscience, he loved his neighbor and lived according to integrity and sincerity in all his dealings. Likewise, the Apostle Paul strived to live out integrity and godly sincerity. When some in Corinth tried to undermine his authority as an apostle for Jesus, he defended his conduct among them. He wrote that his words and actions could withstand the closest scrutiny. He also showed that he was dependent on God's power and grace for effectiveness, not his own. In short, Paul's faith in Christ permeated all his dealings. As we live as ambassadors for Jesus, may we be careful to let the good news ring out in all our dealings, family, business, and more. When by God's power and grace we reveal His love to others, we honor Him and love our neighbors well. Today's Our Daily Bread devotional scripture reading is from 2 Corinthians chapter 1, verses 12 through 16. Now, this is our boast. Our conscience testifies that we have conducted ourselves in the world, and especially in our relations with you, with integrity and godly sincerity. We have done so relying not on worldly wisdom, but on God's grace. For we do not write you anything that you cannot read or understand. And I hope that, as you have understood us in part, you will come to understand fully that you can boast of us, just as we will boast of you, in the day of the Lord Jesus. Because I was confident of this, I wanted to visit you first, so that you might benefit twice. I wanted to visit you on my way to Macedonia, and to come back to you from Macedonia, and then to have you send me on my way to Judea. Now let's share a word of prayer. Dear Lord, help us to serve others with such a clear conscience that our love for them is evident. Thank you, Lord. It's in Jesus' name that we pray. Amen. Thanks so much for listening today. My name is Wes Ward. And today's encouragement was provided by Our Daily Bread Ministries.